Hey gorgeous people, I thought I would jump in um, and just quickly share a little bit of the magic and majesty and lore of today's BOGO with doTERRA which is buy one laurel, get one caraway free. So this is the beautiful laurel leaf, ah, succulent beautiful essential oil. And then when you purchase this, you receive this caraway free. So laurel leaf, as the name indicates, comes from the leaf of the laurel tree. This is what we used to see, or you know, in depictions of old, as a wreath around the victors at the Greek Olympics and Romans used to do it as well. And that wreath of laurel was the sign of the victor, he or she, who has now, metaphysically, the confidence to step forward in life to be who they are truly meant to be. And this is the sign of the visionary, <laughs> the triumphant. And if we look deeper into that and look at how we can triumph over our own fears, and then the caraway comes from the seed. So like the fennel, coriander seed, cardamom. These access the capacity for us to fulfill the depth and breadth of who we are. If you imagine the seeds of potentiality being planted within your sacred cauldron, in your belly, within the cave of your heart space and within your mind and when you can bring alignment with them you come into this celebratory space of being who you are truly meant to be in the world which is so what we're all looking for right so let me take you a little bit into each i won't keep you too long today but I would love to really share some of the beautiful gifts that these essential oils bring. So at a physical level, laurel leaf, which is for those with doTERRA essential oils, you'll see it in the Easy Air, also known as Breathe Blend. That beautiful clarifying blend, it brings this clarifying cleansing effect to this whole area here, to the chest area to this area here when you feel like you're congested when you feel like you're blocked so we're talking physically now mentally metaphysically emotionally when we feel like we can't take that deep breath in it prevents us from really receiving life and all of her gifts so the laurel leaf invites us to accept accept with the breath accept this newness of life and in this time of turmoil and chaos, laurel is such a beautiful essential oil to immerse in because it brings us into this beautiful space of the bright shadow. So let me just tell you where I'm, I'm gonna share all of this next part from. So myself and Adam Barraley co-authored this book with Mama Gaia. We brought this book through on the eve of and the day of the summer solstice. And it was very much about us picking up our essential oils, smelling them, connecting with the plant, the deva energy of the plant, connecting with the spirit of Mother Earth, the goddess Gaia, and the messages that wanted to come through. And that's how we brought this book into being. We've also done a lot of research and looked at the ancient history and the lore behind it. So you'll get lots of juiciness there. And for each essential oil, we have a hundred plants that we've brought into being in this book. We have three keywords, the gift, the affirmation, and three master blends. We also have a beautiful practice for each of them. So the three words for laurel, a triumph, bright shadow, and vision. My gift to you is victory. 
The affirmation we've aligned with Laurel is today I celebrate being triumphant. And if we can look at the word triumph and what that brings up in us and where that sits in us, the bright shadow to come back to what I was looking at earlier is this beautiful place you can come to where instead of comparing yourself to others and feeling deflated, feeling less than, or comparing yourself maybe to the way you once were and feeling disempowered, feeling you are less than. Instead of doing that, we can look at this in a new light. So most people, when they undergo shadow work, they get really heavy with it and they go into lots of processing <laughs> and they can stay there for years and years and years. Now, I'm not negating the value of that. I, I am a trained psychologist after all. However, what I do feel is this. I feel like there has been an overemphasis on processing and stuckness and shadow work. Shadow work is actually joyous. It's not that it's not challenging and it's definitely confronting. <laughs> yes, ask me how I know. However, the joy is in the expansive point where you choose to relinquish the density around shadow work and to instead embrace what lives within the shadow. Instead, look at it and say, what are the gifts in there that I choose to really embody and bring into my current embodiment of who I am? And that which doesn't serve, I'm just gonna bow to and say thank you. Thank you for helping me to get to where I am right now, to be who I am right now, and I release you. I release you. You have no hold over me and I have no hold over you. Because often what lies in the shadow is the stuff of mayhem and chaos, the stuff that tears us down and tears us apart. The bright shadow, which is what the majesty of laurel leaf brings, is this. What about those moments where you look at someone and you say, oh my goodness, you are so divine, you are so magical, you are so bright, you are so light, or you are so fit and healthy, you are so intelligent, you are so creative, when we come to those times and we say, I wish I could be more like that, and we feel inspired by it, inspired by the wish, and something kindles in us, and we feel like, hmm, so I love all of these aspects in these different beautiful key people in my life. And it could be deities as well, right? It could be the angelic kingdom. It doesn't matter. And in that moment, you choose this is the bright shadow. You choose to become the embodiment of it. You choose to look at that other personal being and say, I really love that. And so I choose to embrace that in me. Rather than looking at someone and saying, okay, that pushes my button, that pushes my buttons, that pushes my buttons. And it must be that I've got to work on me because it's all pushing my buttons. Now there's merit in that. There's merit in growth, of course. You want to keep growing, you want to keep transforming, and you want to transcend that which holds you back, that which drags you down. However, if you're doing it at the constant expense of your vital forces, what is the point? So how about if you turn it around and brought the gift of laurel leaf to you and instead said, I choose to look at what I see in others that triggers me or inspires me as a gift to me. I choose right now in this moment to relinquish that part of me that doesn't serve the trigger points, the contraction, to relinquish it. And maybe you want to call Archangel Michael in to assist you with this beautiful leaf to simply help you to relinquish attachments and addictions to stuff that doesn't serve you. Addiction to being mean to yourself as well, right? And instead, help him, ask him to help you, <laughs> invite him to assist you and guide you in your journey to becoming the embodiment of all that you want to be. How does that sound? So, it's much more victorious that way, right? So this beautiful essential oil goes down into the heart space, it goes down into the belly, it goes up into the head space. This is gonna bring clarity, deep connection. This would be a gorgeous essential oil with black spruce and jasmine to tap into the wonder and that galactic energy. Um, to go into past lives, Akashic Records. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful essential oil for that. For the visionaries, 
Laurel Leaf is beautiful for those that want to expand their vision and bring their visions into a physical manifestation. So let me read you a little bit about um, Laurel Leaf. Okay. A little bit of the history that you may not know. In ancient Greece, the plant was called Daphne after the mythic mountain nymph of the same name. Apollo found that Daphne, upon whom he had showered his affections, had been transformed into a laurel tree to avoid Apollo's advances. So Apollo had many lovers. He was, he was partial to men and women and loved to love. <laughs> to console himself, Apollo fashioned wreaths of laurel. Since then, a laurel wreath is associated with the golden god and is a symbol of the highest status. Working with laurel helps pave the path towards success and victory. And being an evergreen plant, the oil also passes on the vibration of immortality. So a gorgeous one to combine with oils like Melissa and Helichrysum. If you are ready to make a significant and long-lasting impact on the, in the world, laurel is an oil to align with. So imagine laurel with this gorgeous caraway and rose, the seeds of your potential coming into being, embracing all of you, the bright shadow in all of the world and being the embodiment of all you choose to be <clears throat> with the unconditional love of rose, reminding you to love all aspects of you. We have a gorgeous blend here called um, Seas Victory. And it's a gorgeous one to work with the leaf kingdom and a rhizome. So let me tell you what's in it. Laurel, basil, ginger, beautiful warming rhizome, and peppermint. Combine laurel with peppermint for clarity, and basil for your focus to keep your sights on the prize. Add the drive of ginger and you have a mighty winner's blend. Diffuse these four oils when you have an important task to fulfill or you want to ensure you don't just become distracted. One more I'll share with you from our beautiful book is Apollo and his lovers. So this is a beautiful one to tune into your, you know, yummy frequency of loving and connecting in love. It's Laurel, beautiful majestic cypress, and Rose, Aphrodite, Venus energy coming in. Apollo had much to give and had many lovers, attuned to the power of radiant love by blending Laurel, the nymph Daphne, and Cypress, the beautiful youth, Suprasius, add rose, which Apollo helped to create, and you have a blend that captures this godly essence used to promote an optimistic view of love. Isn't that gorgeous? So we have in our book lots of the history about how these oils came into being. Rose was one that was um, brought into being with lots of gods and goddesses. Anyway, that's going to be for another day because I'll never get to caraway. Okay, so <laughs> caraway. So while... Um, laurel leaf is fresh in the sense of that leafy freshness, expansiveness. Caraway has this beautiful freshness in a very earthy way. Think, think like anise type oils, fennel type oils. That tiny kiss of that, that essence is coming through here. That real warmth coming through here. So it's going to be a good one for tummy. Yeah, it's going to be a good one for tummy support. When you feel like you have tummy flutters, when you feel like you have anxious feelings, when you feel the fear preventing you from moving forward, that's where caraway and laurel would be so beautiful combined together. You could make a gorgeous roller bottle with them. I've just got this one here. I've been using this one flat out. And just anoint yourself with them. Yeah? So, with caraway... If you're looking at the seeds of potential that I was talking about earlier, summon the energy of the seeds to you. You can diffuse them, you can make a spritzer bottle to clear your space with it and bless your space. And I have a beautiful blend here, seeds of potential, caraway, fennel and coriander, all succulent seeds. What I've done is I've created, and I'll post them to the gram soon, um, some beautiful blends and melodies that you can put together and a gorgeous succulent body butter with caraway because you see caraway is the this powerful essential oil that brings with it the gift of consecration so you can actually consecrate your sacred space you can consecrate yourself i.e bless yourself and your space so it's beautiful for those of you that love to come into sacred ritual 
you can anoint the various parts of yourself you can anoint your sacred altar you can put it in a spritzer bottle and just bless your space with it yeah so you might want to do that with caraway rosemary frankincense and myrrh gorgeous melody to consecrate and bless your space in and as you do it just call in 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 the way that you do those beautiful energies to work with you and by you as you bless and consecrate your space yeah for a clear path forward you can use caraway with eucalyptus and the laurel leaf so again you're going to take these two and the beautiful eucalyptus another powerfully expansive essential oil in this region here just taking that deep breath in when we can take a deep breath in we move much more fluidly right we engage in life with more grace and with more fluidity so um it's a beautiful essential oil to work with your sacral chakra as well so the sacral is often misunderstood um, cardamom essential oil is beautiful for the sacral as well and for that sexual energy uh, you have um, the sacral energy coming in through also with bringing in this beautiful ray of abundance in that area you know with the golden colors so you can you can get playful with your sacral chakra blend um, I really I really felt into this and I know it's not going with all the colors and blah 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 but this is what I felt would be really yummy for this time for the sacral chakra caraway red mandarin tangerine which incidentally was the free oil this month uh, ginger and turmeric so you're bringing in this beautiful golden ray of abundance working with the sacral energy just to help you feel safe and guided in that place again okay so there's more blends there as well that i'll share with you later just check out my grid and they will all be there so i hope this has been beautiful i hope this has blessed you deeply i promise not to keep you too long and i've probably been a while now so always happens but i love you all so much all you need to do now for those that are existing doTERRA customers is jump onto your back office and order your laurel leaf it's just you buy one laurel leaf and when you go to check out you'll get the caraway free you have up to five per account that you can order of these beautiful gift giving for christmas time i have a recipe in my grid now in my um insta feed which has a gorgeous rainbow salad perfect for summer here in the southern hemisphere with caraway seed dressing i've given you two um, variations on yummy dress recipes there for you so if you don't have your own doTERRA customer account so that you receive 25% off everything in these beautiful BOGO offerings send me a DM I'd love to help you um, I have gorgeous gift packs put together and beautiful roller bottles and spritz bottles and accessories and, and booklets so that you know how to use your essential oils plus you get me to journey with so have a gorgeous day. I love you deeply. Know that there are so many beings right now here assisting us. Lean into them. Lean into the light rather than the despair. That's my invitation to you today. Let these beautiful essential oils come into your life and bless you with their lightness and brightness. Tap into all you are grateful for and have a beautiful day, rich with love and laughter and friendship. I'll see you soon.